Hey YouTube and welcome to Leah's Handmade Crafts episode number 24 and I didn't need my book this time. Admittedly I did look. Um, today is about some happy mail, a whip, uh, a finished object and some acquisitions. So to start with I'll start with the whip and the whip, well other than my um, shawls I decided I needed something quick and easy so using the Karen cupcakes I'm making myself a granny beanie now I think I'm probably going to need a second ball of this to finish it off but that's okay it's a start and I do have another ball of this coming I'm just not sure when it's going to arrive but this is the beanie so far so I'm pretty happy with that I love the colors uh, the colorway is Bear with me. The colourway is candy buttons. So that's on its way. My finished object is a tea towel topper. Now I really love this and I love the colours. The only problem is I used four ply or fingering weight as opposed to a worsted weight and so it's a lot lighter and not quite as sturdy as I see it sort of it pulls so but that's okay it does the job it hangs the tea towel which is what I want and I really love the color combination so that's um, using the Lincraft four ply in the colorway purple purple um, and so that's that. Next time I will use a, an 8 ply as opposed to a 4 ply, but I was in a bit of a hurry and anyway. On to acquisitions. I collect and I collect them for a reason. I've got a few patterns in mind, but whenever I see these discounted and cheap, I buy them. So normally these would sell at... Um, 12 to 15 dollars a ball I got them for five dollars so two of the jeans in the colorway brand new so two of those five dollars each bargain and these two were 50% off so I bought two because you know one is never enough and I really love the color it's the Cambridge Tweed in the hometown USA so I'm planning on using that for some big button cows. So I'm a bit excited about that. And it's so soft. Um, I got two for the price of one. So I paid $7 a ball for these. Um, normally $14 a ball. So as you can see, I never buy them when they're full price because they charge an absolute arm and a leg here. And my Happy Mail is from Carla from Crochet CJ. We're, we've become quite good friends uh, via our Zoom and our um, Facebook Messenger group. And um, I was commenting on the fact that I really love the look of the new Lion brand ombres, but there would be no chance that we would be getting them anytime soon in Australia because we've only just started getting mandalas. And the chance of getting the om a mandala ombre was who knows how long because it has to be moved on to the rest of the states other than just Walmart so Carla God bless her offered to send a couple of balls to me so this morning I went to the post office and lo and behold in the in the post office was my parcel now Carla sent it on the 21st and I only just received it this morning so that gives you an idea of how long it takes to get from the states to Australia so anyway, our postal service is very slow over here. It's been in the, in the country for five days before I received it. So, bit of a shocker. But anyway, so there was this lovely card with the package. And these, my friends, are the mandalas. So they're the Harmony range. So there's two Harmonies. Aren't they just gorgeous and then there are two of the mantra 
I absolutely love, love, love these. They are just so gorgeous and I cannot wait to use them. And then, God bless us, she also sent me some stitch markers. So I'll show them each individually because they are just too gorgeous not to show off. There's the ship. There's an octopus. There's an anchor. There's a ship's wheel. There's a crab. And last but not least, there is a beautiful turtle. So, Carla, I absolutely love, love those stitch markers and I can't wait to use these. I don't know yet what I'm going to make with them. In fact, I think one of them, I may make a shawl. I saw a pattern last night for an easy knitted shawl and you use one mandala. So I thought, hmm. And if I don't use a mandala, I might use one of the shawl in a cake so that I've got because I think that's the other thing they suggest so if I don't use these I will use the shawl in a cake but I cannot wait to you put these to some use I'm not sure yet what what I'm making but I shall have some fun with them all the same and I'm really looking forward to making a big button cowl out of this because this is just so soft and so nice and scrumptious so yes and I don't know whether I showed you all but I recently acquired a container full of the handmade with love buttons so I've got these to put on on cowls I've also got some really nice big buttons that would really suit that so I've just got a Play with it a little and have some fun. But anyway, until next time, this is my yarny mail and, and happy mail. Um, until next time, keep crocheting, keep having fun, God bless, and I really balls that up. Let's start again. Keep crocheting, keep crafting, have fun, and God bless.